Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Stay tuned. So for this wash and go, I'll be using the Curls Popping Pineapple Vitamin C Collection. I love that the entire line is formulated with vitamins A, B1, B6, and C. So that's all good, right? Um, right now I'm starting off with the So So Clean Vitamin C Curl Wash. I love that this um shampoo it's very moisturizing it cleanses my hair very well without stripping it um the only thing is that it doesn't really suds too much so i had to add a little bit more to get that foaming effect you know that we all like so yeah this part right here is optional but for me, I wanted to start my year off right, so I'm doing a protein treatment because I needed one so badly. I'm using one of my favorite FOG Keratin 2-Minute Reconstructor. This treatment is supposed to help restore strength and softness back to your hair, especially for someone who has bleached hair, so it's really good. Um, then you just cover it up with a plastic cap and leave it on for two minutes. Then after that you rinse it all off and just follow your normal routine with your deep conditioning and everything else. But one thing I do like about this treatment is that afterwards your hair do feel strong and soft at the same time. So worth a try if you guys have never tried it before so yeah next step I'm using the so so moist vitamin C curl mask as you can see I had a little bit of trouble getting it out of the bottle since the product is so thick so it would have been so much better in a jar but anyway the mask is amazing it's moisturizing and easy to apply and it was it made the detangling process a breeze so i liked it one thing i didn't include is the part where i sat under my steamer for 15 minutes but this is the after math of that and as you can see my curls are popping my hair looks great roots look strong and thick so that's really good Now for the fun part guys, for styling process I always use the LOC method and that's your leave-in, your oil and your cream in that order. Um, right now I'm applying the leave-in conditioner and I love how it melts in my hair and I like how moisturizing my hair felt afterwards and easy for me to get my fingers through so that was nice um, the scalp treatment oil I'm using that to seal in my hair it has a little bit of mint in there so I like tingly feeling that it gave my scalp so that was nice because the line doesn't have a cream so I had to use one of my staples from the melanin hair care products I like the jelly, um, but I don't feel like for my hair type, it was great, but it's nice. It gives you, it has a very light hold. So for a wash and go, for me, it's not great, but I think it will be good for like twist outs or something like that. Or maybe for someone with um, looser curl pattern, patterns maybe, but for me, um, I wasn't getting that curl definition I usually get so yeah 
it's pretty nice actually it's not too heavy doesn't weigh my hair down um yeah so just working off the sections but i did get a little bit of curl definition but not as much as i wanted mm, that's that I don't know what I was thinking here guys I applied the hair hair paint wax on fully wet hair and not damp hair I chose the gold color because I thought it was going to match my bleach ends a little bit more and give me that I don't know that pop I was looking for but um, I didn't really get that and I, I think I didn't do a really good job at <laughs> distributing the wax in my hair because as you can see some of the products was just sitting on my hair and that wasn't cool but anyway I worked with it I made it work right now I'm just using I used um, medium heat to dry my hair and now I'm just um, stretching the roots a little bit so I can get some volume. Here we are guys, it's the next day and this is what my hair <laughs> looks like after I slept on it and as you can see I have to stretch it and fluff it all over again so enjoy the process. <laughs> That's my baby in the background, so don't mind him. Um, right now, I'm just going to continue fluff, fluffing my hair a little bit more because I want it to look a lot more fuller than what it was. So, yeah, this is the end result, guys. I loved how everything came out. It's so soft, bouncy. Um, curl definition, not too much, but I just, I like the entire look. It's great. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, comment, and let me know what you think. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Keep up with me. Thank you. Bye.